Hi everyone, this is Technotix B and today I'm going to show you how you can enable the virtual gyroscope sensor by using your accelerometer and compass. Before I go into it, maybe you guys already have guessed the name of this phone. This is L1S and this phone lacks gyroscope sensor. I had installed the sensor kinetic app which will verify all the sensor present in your mobile and this is showing there is no gyroscope sensor present in this phone. Now let's talk about what you need. First your phone should be rooted or I would say Expo should have been installed. If you have then this video is useful for you and you have done almost half of your work. Just you need to install a module which name is virtual sensor. There is Expo's link given in the description of this video to download this APK or you can download via Expo's installer app. As I have already downloaded this app, its size is about 900 KB. To install simply click on it and I have already installed and I don't want to replace it so cancel. Now open Expose Installer and enable the module Virtual Sensor and reboot the device. That's it, let's first go in the Expose to verify our module is perfectly installed or not. And it seems there is no issue in installations. Now if you want to verify, open the app which is called Sensor Kinetics and it is showing there is virtual gyroscope sensor. This virtual sensor accuracy is dependent on your accelerometer and compass accuracy. Now let's compare the difference between before and after this module. As you can see there is nothing happening while rotating the phone. Up and down, left and right, there is nothing happening. Now let's switch after enabling this module. And here is the result, while rotating the phone position is changing. And here you can see, they entirely cave. In this module, when you are rotating up and down, there is no issue. But when you are rotating left to right, nothing is going to change. Look like one axis orientation is not working. Might be this will fix in the future update. So that's it for this video. If you found this video is useful then say thanks to the developer. I have given the link of that in the description of this video who had posted this on XGA. And in last thank you to all subscribers that subscribe my channel. 